Welcome, passengers. This is Captain Rufflecopter here, and on this flight, we'll be going into loadouts. I don't know, sure, maybe this is gameplay and tutorials. Yeah, and I'm joined with my most active uh, Steam community friend, which is Bronas Evil. Let's just uh, close. In there. So, basically, we're just going to yeah. be talking about loadouts starting from Scott all the way through Spy. And I'm going to ask him for his favorite loadout. So, right here, this is my favorite loadout, and I think is the best for Scout, which is don't just. Don't mind the miscellaneous, just mind the weapons. Uh, scatter gun, pistol, and the atomizer. The atomizer allows triple de triple, triple uh, dropping, even though it uh, minuses like 10 health, but it's good. It's really good. And uh, you know, because what you will be mostly concentrating on your guns anyway, like these guns, not your melee weapons. So it's pretty good as well. So, what's your favorite loadout for Scout? The normal um scatter gun, mm -hmm. the the flying guillotine, and the Sandman. I don't have the yeah, flying yeah, guillotine. The MLG stuff. Yep. The what does it do exactly? Well, the Sandman will bonk people, make them stun, throw the guillotine at somebody, and it will crit them. So that is a really good one, but it's very very yeah. situational. And I don't like being very situational. <laughs> I like to hit scan people. Next one, soldier. Well, I have almost no favorites, but uh, the basic thing is that I've got a shotgun and an escape plan. I switch between rocket launcher, delivery launcher, but my favorite one and the most fun, and I usually use it a lot for pushes, is the beggar's bazooka. What is yours? Yeah, he did love it. My just the, my normal rocket launcher, and I die right here, splat <laughs> my face into the ground. So rocket launcher, next is yeah. The shotgun and the market gardener. Market gardener. I use the escape plan just yes. for escape because it's really good for escape. Because if you use the escape plan <laughs> for escape, you are able to run away from enemies. And rocket launcher and shotgun is easy. So you're like, if you lose all your rockets, especially when you're using the liberal launcher or the uh, black box, once you lose all your rockets, you have to wait for your reloading speed. Hey, your reloading speed is really long. And then you just pick up your shotgun. It'll it'll uh, it'll quickly dispatch enemies. Usually, I would if some yeah. in my cases, if I'm like running away from an enemy, I like to open hold the shotgun when I'm running away from an enemy. I mean, like I need to go for health, so I could quickly dispatch guys that also go for the health. Next one, pyro. My favorite one is this, which is a pretty much defensive pyro. The degreaser, the shotgun, and the neon annihilator. Which the degreaser will quick switch between these all. And wait, I'm not yet finished. The degreaser quick switches them. The shotgun, I get to air blast and shoot them with the shotgun. And besides, I get to dispatch enemies really easily in the distance. And then the neon annihilator, which basically is an uh, is to help uh, s s s s s s NGs remove sappers. What is yours? Is it the degreaser pyro? Mine is the... just almost this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm the, gonna say. the extinguisher and the vintage <laughs> flare gun. Well, basically the flare gun. I got the vintage one. So yeah, that's what I this is. I usually use my shotgun. You mean your shotgun with it? Just with just change it with the yeah, extinguisher, yeah. right? Yeah. This is more of an aggressive pyro, more than a, more than this is more uh, offensive. This is what what this is defensive. I use this for defense. This is for offense. I can't choose between the cap and the hat. Next one, demo man. My <laughs> mostly used demo man loadout is this, but I don't use it. I don't play demo man a lot. Which is basically the grenade launcher, the the sticky bomb launcher, and uh, a bottle. But basically, I've got a ton of melee weapons. But I use the frying pan because demo man. What is yours? Same as yours. And okay. I also have the pen. Yeah. You I saw really a frying pan. You you saw a scout panning video, right? Oh, it's awesome. Now for yeah. heavy, <laughs> it's kind of a mix, but this is absolutely my favorite. One of my favorites, and that is the Tomislav the sandwich and the gloves of running urgently. The gloves of running urgently allows you to move faster, allowing you to get to the battlefield much more quicker. Sandwich is very very helpful. It allows you to heal up when there's no medic. It allows you to. Heal your medic when there's no health packs around in, in battle. And the Thomas Lab, when like in emergencies, like you, you could quickly switch the you know to your Thomas Lab. It'll quickly turn up the wind up the barrel, and then you could fire even though the fire speed is slower. But sometimes I also switch it off with the mega gun. But the Thomas Lab, seriously, that's good. What's yours? Mine is the normal uh, minigun, 
the sandwich and the glove of running urgently. So yes, yeah, yeah. like kind of like mine. Engineer, now this I have yeah. plenty of favorites, but uh, here's my favorite so far. I just switched the Wrangler between the pistol. Basically, it's Rescue Ranger, Wrangler, and the Wrench. I switched. Uh, this is for offensive. This is for defensive. So yeah, Rescue Ranger is really uh, it's <clears throat> like it fixes up plenty of the problems that an engineer used to have. The Wrangler allows you to like aim uh, aim guys at a distance, and the uh, Wrench really easy and vintage. It allows you to uh, like smack spies in the eyeball if you need to. Yeah, what's yours? What is it? Look, oh, I don't have uh, for the NG. I don't have. What's your mostly used? What do My you favorite. use most? The Wheelmaker, the the Wrangler, and the Gunslinger. Ooh. Yep. So it's an engineer. Okay. Medic. Yeah. Now this is my most favorite use. I mean, med uh, medic gun. <laughs> my favorite medic loadout. And this is the Blood Saga, the Blood Soldier, the Medic Gun, and the Uber Saw. I might even want to try and test it out with the Overdose. These are basically several of my favorites. But, uh, yeah. It allows you to run away from enemies, and the Blood Saga is especially effective to regain your health. So when in battle, you're already at a distance, you could shoot at an enemy, and you gain some some of your health for every hit. Medic gun really easy, it pops an uber. What what I see lots of new medics do right now is like they use the vaccinator, which is kind of which sucks, absolutely sucks. I mock people using the vaccinator these <laughs> days. It's because that uh, compared to the medic gun, it's like the medic gun is like all of those when you uber somebody, it's like all of those resistances, all of the vaccinator resistances combined and maximized to a hundred percent. So no fire damage, no explosion damage, no bullet damage, no. No, no one, whatever damage. So you can't. So basically, you're absolutely Except invincible. Except for the melee. Yeah, there's no blood wand. Except for the melee. It's called blood wand or something. I don't know. And the uber saw. It's really good. It's um. So when I get the chance, like there's a spy, I could slash him. It's really good. Oh, wait, what's yours? Yeah, and you are a medic. You will kind of get a random crit. Yes. Yeah, Interestingly, I have also discovered that if you have got uh, the the crits actually increase, the crit chances increase the the more you get uber charged. So, what's your favorite loadout for medic? The crusaded crossbow, the the uber star, and the normal medic gun. Yep. Use the crusaders crossbow. Okay. I I, yeah. I don't like using the crusaders crossbow because I don't like the aiming, but the crusaders crossbow is a really good <laughs> weapon. But I uh, I don't know. Next one, sniper. Obviously, you have a good loadout for sniper and spy. Now, my most favorite <laughs> is using the Luxman. But sometimes I do switch out to the Sydney sniper. At least I get to help people like Gerade, leaving them absolutely vulnerable. So I use a Sydney sniper. I sometimes, but basically I don't have much of the favorites. But I like to be outdoorsy. I like to use the Luxman. So what is yours? <laughs> I know. I I could guess. I could guess. It's the. Bot yeah. killer, sniper rifle, a Gerade, <laughs> and the bushwhacker. I've been playing him with a lot, so I could tell what he's what his favorite, right? <laughs> I could tell. Right? 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 All right? Yeah. Yeah. Next one, yeah. spy. Yeah. Now, I got I know I got the genuine distinguished My rogue. Favorite. Yeah, it's his favorite. But I seriously don't want this. I want the uh Popis physicists. Now, this is kind of my favorite. Sometimes I do switch it out with the the Letrange Le and the uh, Your Eternal Reward. But yeah, this is my spy loadout. It's a vanilla one. What's your favorite? What's your use, most use? The, f my f the first favorite of mine is I use the Ambassador for my gun, the Dead Ringer for my watch, and the, the normal knife. And the second one is the. Uh, the Doctor Enforcicle, the Spicicle, the the Enforcer, and the Dead Ringer. The third one is, yeah, you know, the Siren. Because I never really, really like Siren Spy. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, he's a really good spy. He had, you can see in my birthday video, who actually backstabbed me twice. I credit his kills. But, yeah. That's pretty much all of his loadouts. There are also plenty of bad loadouts in the world. 
But yeah, these are all the loadouts, starting the best loadouts from my perspective and from my friend's perspective. Starting from Scout, Soldier, Pyro, Devilman, Heavy, Engineer, Medic, Sniper, and Spy. So yes, I thank you for watching uh, this uh, short video of mine. As always, like, comment, subscribe to this LN to see more and to catch the next flight. Until then, I'll be ready for takeoff as always. Ta-ta for now, au revoir. See you later. Don't forget to join our group.